It's just a moment that happened to be on camera. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we'll be discussing the stories behind the 10 most famous kisses in history. Such a beautiful example of, of love and passion and romance in art, and that is such an appealing sculpture. Uh, but it actually tells a much more grim story than most people know. For this list, we'll be looking at situations that led to or surround the most iconic images, videos, paintings, and more featuring the art of the kiss. Did any of these stories surprise you? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. The Star Trek Lip Lock There is a lot of debate as to what exactly constituted the first interracial kiss on television. However, there's arguably no scripted TV episode that captures the dramatic spirit of the moment more than this lip lock from the original Star Trek. But I'm not afraid. I am not afraid. Actress Nichelle Nichols documented in her 1994 autobiography that she and co-star William Shatner intentionally messed up while filming the smoochless version of the scene. This was so that the more explicit take, one actually showing the kiss, would be used for the final product. Let's get on with it. You are so impatient, my wife. Observe the doctor and learn. He's quite content to wait for the piece de resistance. Some behind the scenes on Star Trek were initially worried that pushback might occur from some regions of the United States. Some did, but overall, the episode aired without major incident. Here was the thing. You get one nasty letter and you get a hundred really great letters. It was a step forward, I think. Number 9. Gas Mask Embrace the story of Christmas in England in the year of the Blitz, 1940. Perhaps you'd like to see it. According to reports, this photo was taken in 1940, during the Second World War. This sentiment perhaps seems obvious, but there's nothing nefarious going on behind the scenes. Instead, the pair behind the gas mask kiss was reportedly staging this scene in order to demonstrate how air raid warnings of the time had dampened much of the UK's holiday spirit. So far as possible, this will be an old-fashioned Christmas in England. The image of the two gas masks beneath a sprig of mistletoe is a striking one, to be sure. But the original British text that supports the photo claims that the duo did in fact take their masks off for the real deal after this picture was taken. Mary, I, I didn't want to make you cry. Well, there's nothing wrong with crying at a time like this. Number 8. A smooch at the Berlin Wall. Thousands and thousands of West Germans come to make the point that the wall has suddenly become irrelevant. Something, as you can see, almost a party on. How do you measure such an astonishing moment in history? The fall of the Berlin Wall in 1989 was a cause for much celebration, yet many in Germany remembered exactly how this division between East and West had caused so much pain and heartache. As a result, folks reacted to news of the wall's imminent collapse in different ways, from tears to joy. If, if there is someone who, uh, who sleeps for eight weeks and you told him what happened here, he thinks you're crazy. It's, it's unthinkable. This photo captures a young couple kissing in front of it not long before its fall in 1989 and symbolizes a lot of things to many different people. Freedom immediately comes to mind, but also hope, promise, and opportunity. This photo is a happy one, but many will never forget what it took to get the country to this point. Your government seems to be changing every day. Where do you think it's going? <laughs> That's the government's problem, he says. Not mine. Number 7. Klimt's Kiss Klimt is often dismissed by critics today as an artist who simply produced decorative artifice. But his work served as an important role in bridging academic realism and the coming world of abstraction. The Austrian painter Gustav Klimt utilized amorous themes within much of his work. However, his oil-on-canvas piece, The Kiss, sits amongst his most famous creations. Museum shops from around the world sell thousands of items inspired by details from this 1908 painting, from tote bags and posters to umbrellas and teddy bears. The image is powerful and demonstrates how passion and love can be transformative for the human experience. Klimt finished the kiss hot on the heels of another project, the Vienna ceiling paintings, that saw some labeling the artist's work as being too sexual. However, the kiss today is not seen as smut, but as a triumph of modern art by one of its most iconic personalities. The decorative elements and the use of gold leaf in the kiss almost resemble those of a religious painting, making the portrait a timeless representation of immortal love and devotion. Number 6. Rodin's Kiss 
Klimt wasn't the only famous artist to create an enduring piece of art labeled The Kiss. French sculptor Auguste Rodin was the man behind another iconic work, a nude couple captured in 1882, forever locked in a marble embrace. You see, the man embraces the woman and she embraces him back. She pulls him towards her and it shows clear desire on the part of the woman. Now that was a very unusual thing to see in art. The story behind Rodin's kiss is taken from Dante's Inferno, with the woman in question being Francesca da Rimini. Rimini was a noblewoman who had a love affair with the younger brother of her husband, Giovanni Malatesta. And you and I are going to take this to our coffins. I can't do that. Why not? I'm in love with you. Of it. The sculpture captures Francesca and the brother Paolo about to kiss, when, as the story goes, they are discovered and murdered by the husband. As a result, the kiss sits as a tragic story about love, betrayal, passion, and ultimately, death. And that's how they end up in hell, in the second circle, where they are seen in a whirlwind of adulterers, and where they forever will try to get to one another, but will never actually kiss. Number 5. The Fraternal Kiss The Fraternal Kiss also goes by another more dramatic moniker, one that states, My God, help me to survive this deadly love. At times in our lives, we can all find ourselves stuck between the lips of these kind of monsters. The painting features Leonid Brezhnev of the former Soviet Union and Germany's Erich Honecker locked in an embrace, and was one of the most famous pieces of graffiti art to be created on the Berlin Wall. The original instance of the kiss and the resulting photo took place on October 7, 1979, when Brezhnev had gone to what was then East Germany. I would very much like that our relations go down in history as relations of peace, of friendship, of mutual respect between our peoples. What's perhaps most striking is the differences in tone between the photo and painting. The original kiss acted as a fraternal greeting between two communist nations. The 1990 reproduction for its part seems to largely satirize communism's failure in Germany. There were still East German border guards standing on the wall. They didn't let me cross over to the West, but later, when I started to paint, they gave me water to mix in. Number 4. The Judas Kiss not every kiss is performed with the intent of love or affection. Welcome, Rabbi. The kiss of Judas refers to the biblical story, wherein Judas Iscariot kisses Jesus Christ in order to betray and identify him to officials. It's here where the story of Christ's arrest, trial, and eventual crucifixion essentially begins, forever marking Judas as one of the best-known traitors. Judas. Must you betray me with a kiss? The Judas kiss has been captured many times in art over the years and can represent the act of kissing as symbolically hiding true, more nefarious intentions. This symbolism can also be seen in other famous examples, such as when Michael Corleone kisses his brother Fredo in The Godfather Part Two. These are but two examples of the act that represent tragedy. You broke my heart. You broke my heart. Number 3. The Vancouver Riot Embrace This is a great example of how perception can alter how we view something, or the story we ascribe to it in our heads. It's one of the last places you'd expect to find romance <laughs> is in the middle of a riot, but that's exactly what was going on with this couple. During the Vancouver Hockey Riots of 2011, an image quickly went viral one that depicted a couple kissing amidst all of the chaos. However, the moment wasn't born out of the most tender circumstances. Indeed, the duo, Scott Jones and Alex Thomas, had been knocked down to the ground by riot police. I don't know why we weren't being aggressive towards them or anything like that, but then eventually they passed over us, uh, and that's when we were on the ground. They were caught in a situation that was scary, to put it mildly. The kiss was Jones's way of calming Thomas down. Romantics will be happy to know that as of 2021, the couple are reportedly still together. It's definitely a good story to tell. I'm gonna hang on to him. Number 2. The First Film Kiss The clip barely lasts 20 seconds, but there it is, in all its not-so-sultry glory. It's the first smooch captured on film, and it was directed by William Heise. The 1896 short, succinctly titled, you guessed it, The Kiss, was actually distributed by Thomas Edison's company. It features a live-action reproduction of a smooch that occurs during the stage play, The Widow Jones. Away, 
It sits alongside another famous example of cultural significance that came out only two years later. This is usually dubbed the first black kiss on film and was actually considered to be lost until it was found in 2017 and saved for posterity. The world will always welcome love as time goes by. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. The Times Square Smooch It's one of the most famous kisses in history, yet also one of the most controversial. Titled VJ Day in Times Square, the photo shows a sailor in the United States Navy locking lips with a woman as New York celebrates the end of the Second World War. It was the moment that you come back from the Pacific and finally you know the war ends. Many have claimed to be the two people in the picture over the years, but today, it's largely agreed that the woman was a dental assistant named Greta Zimmer Friedman, and the act was not consensual. And before I knew it, I was in this tight grip. How long did you kiss her? Not long. According to Friedman, the sailor in the photo grabbed her, and she actually didn't know him. As a result, this Times Square couple were actually anything but, which shines a different light upon one of America's most well-recognized images. Uh, there was a great spirit, uh, a national spirit of unity and a uh, unity of purpose in winning the war. And Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.